Well, just as Grandmaster, you said, you don't want to get old. You just want to add some years. Well, these guys, you want to be young. And they really have got a lot of energy. We're going to move next to black belt forms. And each of these forms, just like the Teguk forms, have a meaning to them. So Master Lee will be coming back out, and he's going to begin with the form choreo. Okay? And it's a form that every black belt student in Taekwondo has faced the challenge of trying to learn. It literally represents a learned man with a very strong martial spirit, but at the same time a virtuous, righteous person as well. That is a person who discovers their own strength, but never misuses it and seeks justice. Again, Master Sang Ho Lee, the first Pumse for the black belt forms, Corel.
reflects the source of life for all creatures and represents the place where we humans live out our lives as well. First, and then I have to correct that the uh, master that's Hang Li is the 2003, October 15, he earned the 60 degree black belts. Then an also is testing for seven and today. But the, and during the testing, and I'm going to ask him questions. But those questions, and I have to speak the Korean, so I'm sure many people will not understand then his choice whether he would like to answer English or in Korean. But we must ask him as it in a Korean words. So, and Master Lee. Okay. Uh, good yes, job. sir. Uh, the next Pumse in this series, Ship Jin, the word ten longevity, refers to the ten items that produce longevity in life. Air, water, the elements. But it points to ceaseless development. Development never stops. It points to those things that give us faith, hope, and love. struggling in life by being grounded and focused. 